Gaffer, 2 0 victory over Northampton Town. You must be very satisfied with that result. Yeah, satisfied with the result. You know, any any win in a, in a derby is especially nice. Um, I wasn't pleased with the first 15, 20 minutes, to be honest. I thought we were we sack, we, we started second best, but um, we got a goal. Great header with the captain. We got a quick second. We It's just such a good finish. It's incredible. The wee man continues to date Jack Murray. That's why he's. That's why he, Everyone upstairs wants him. He's he's tremendous. And then in, in the second half, I'm I'm I must admit now I'm disappointed we didn't get a third one with Gwian. Gets it stuck under his feet. But in the second half we managed the game. There was a, a real criticism by the dressing room to um perhaps at previous times about game management and we I think we gave an example today on the one occasion with Leo that we gave a good example to game manager. But um it's a derby, any type of win does. And um and they're always for the supporters, every one of them. Yeah, aside from his goal, Jack Baldwin was excellent, wasn't he? He marshalled that back line superbly. I thought there was a lot of big performances today. Jack gets the goal and, and won a lot of headers and um, controlled headers as well a lot of times. Really, really pleased at certain aspects of the play going forward where we, we didn't go in too early, which we've been tending to do in recent weeks, and we didn't we didn't overplay for the majority of time. But... I think if I'm looking for an example of how we how we should have the character to play football here, just look at Gwen Edwards. You know, he's he's not under a reserve game. He said nothing. I think he was mentally shocked when I told him just before an hour before kickoff that he was starting. But um, I, th- I thought he gave everything. And and young Joe Ward, I thought I thought they two are, are, were um, absolutely fantastic in terms of energy for the team. But all of them, the bench as well. And I did say to the players, you know, long before. You know, we went to Rotherham that it's going to take all the squad and it will. Yeah, you, you played Joe Ward up front in a, in a reserve game, didn't you, as well? And he, he showed just endless, boundless energy. Well, I've seen the kid play at Brighton um, before he went off to, to join Woking and he wanted an opportunity. He had an opportunity to sign a three or four year contract at Brighton. You know, it's the people at Brighton that told me that. But the kid wanted to go and play football and it was a, seemed a big decision. But he believed if he went to non league like Woking that. He could come again, and, and that was good advice. I'm a big believer in that. Go and play football, and he did. I was really, really pleased for him. You know, he's a good kid, but he works as hard as that. Gives himself a chance to play, takes it down, and actually doesn't play. That's just the mechanic for all of them. Yeah, a lot of tackles in the game in t- from Northampton, particularly. I mean, th- in terms of your lads, you manage that situation well, not getting dragged into anything like that. I must admit, there's there's two things that that stick out to me today. The tackle of Marcus Madison is horrific. It's got no place in football. Uh, young Powley, who I, I gave his football league debut to that young man, but he should be utterly ashamed tonight of that challenge. The referee didn't deem it appropriate for a red. That was a good referee, Michael Salisbury, and uh, he's got a big future, but I'm sure when Michael looks at that later, he'll he'll think it was nothing other than the red. And the disappointing thing as well is that, that Jack Marriott's goal's onside. It's onside, clearly onside. And, and, but that's not the referee, that's the assistant. So we we look at those two aspects. And, uh, and perhaps Northampton are unfortunate to have a red card I think perhaps there's not a lot in that um, but we've got the win it's a derby and, and that's for the push fans